Hello everyone, my name is Oscar, I'm the teacher of computer science. My channel helps the students to do computer science assessment. Subscribe, like, share and comment to get more new videos. Let's go right now. Assessment number two. Question number one. Explain the many difference between the USB and the HDMI ports. Question number two. Suggest the disadvantages to the following devices. Laptop. Tablet. Smartphone. Question number three. Dis de de describe what is used for standalone and network the la laptop computer. Question number four. Is a laptop hardware maintenance difficult comparing to a desktop computer maintenance? Explain. Question number five. What is a mobile operating system? Name the mobile operating systems on the figure below. Answers. The difference between HDMI and the USB ports is summarized into the following table. HDMI means High Definition Multimedia Interface, while USB means Universal Serial Bus. HDMI port supports one device at a time, but USB port can support one to 127 devices. HDMI port does not transport electricity, while USB port transports both data and electricity at the same time. Answer to the question number two. These are advantages of laptops. Laptops have limit the battery life. Laptops are difficult to repair and upgrade. Laptops can be stolen or lost. Some laptop users find them difficult to use pointing device. These are advantages of tablets. Tablets have limited the memory compared to laptops. Tablets are expensive to use 3G or 4G internet. Typing can be more difficult compared to a normal keyboard. These are advantages of smartphones. The smartphones have small screens which make them difficult to read. Smartphones battery life is short. Smartphones have limited storage or memory compared to others. Answer to the question number three. The difference between standalone laptop and networked laptop is summarized within the following table. Standalone, standalone laptops can be either used for personal or work use. Standalone laptops can be used 
as the tool of communications and the standalone laptops can be also used to play different types of computer games. Network the laptops are used to access on the internet. They should be used to share resources like printers, memories and so on. Network the laptops are used to share files and network the laptops because they are connected. They are interconnected with others can be used to play online gaming or games. Answer to the question number four. The response is yes, because laptop hardware maintenance is difficult compared to the desktop hardware maintenance. This is due to that the components of laptops are specific. It means that you cannot take one laptop component from one brand and replace it with another laptop component from a different brand but the desktop hardware components are standardized or just they are universal you can replace one desktop component from one brand to another desktop component from another brand Answer to the question number five. A mobile operating system is a software that allows smartphones, tablet PCs, and the other devices to run applications and the programs. Mobile operating denoted by Logo A is called Apple's iOS. The mobile operating system denoted by B is called Android OS. The mobile operating system denoted by C is called Windows Phone OS. And the mobile operating system denoted by Letter D is called BlackBerry OS. Thank you for watching my video. But don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment to support my YouTube channel. Thank you.